Old Scream Forest Allotment Garden. I don't do that well at school. I don't listen to teachers. And instead of me just being at home and not learning, they uh, send me up here so I can like learn how to use more tools. But I'm out in the open. It is quite a good place because it's like it's like a school but outdoors. And we're still learning stuff, but at the same time, they sort of treat us like they're adults and they teach us new things. It's it's all right. I wake up and think, oh, cool, go to the allotment, and then once I'm finished, I could go home and I've learned something new during the day. But at the same time, I've been out in the fresh air. The reason why I come in is because I was like same as him. I used to bump with him and everything. Yeah. And swearing at the teachers. Yeah. And that's why I got sent there. Right. But you, you, you're not you're not finding yourself do that here. I mean, there was an awful thing happened over the last few weeks, the shed. I mean, can you tell us a little bit about what you know um, about that? What happened is, is uh, around the night of bonfire, um, or the days after, somebody had broken in and uh, torched it, and it had burnt to the ground. Um, so bit by bit, we're trying to rebuild a new one, but at first we're just building a, a secure... Like, we're building another... Base. Yeah, we're building another place where we can sit in if it's raining so we don't get wet. We mainly need like parts like pieces of wood or like cups and a kettle and different things like plates and that. Just bits and bobs if they can donate anything so we can so we can start rebuilding stuff that we need so we don't get cold during the winter. Mm -hmm. 